Good morning, Gunner. What's up, dude? Are we ready for breakfast? Is that a yes or a maybe? Hey you guys, it's Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Another day, another vlog. Starting off with some bulletproof coffee. So, we'll get the juices flowing. Coconut oil, a little MCT oil, some collagen powder. Yep. Getting it going here. Okay, this right here may not look very pleasant at all. It probably looks pretty disgusting. But it is all the bones I've saved up, not every single one of them, but I've put them in my crock pot and let them cook for about almost three days to make some um, bone meal for my dog for his food. So this is like a combination of different meats and some of them still have, the bones still have some little bit of the meat on it, which is fine. So it's gonna get grinded up really fine with some liver and hopefully some hearts. And I will be making the dog food. I'm not sure I might get around to doing that today. If I do, I will show you guys. Um, but yeah, not pretty, but it turned out to be really good for my doggy. First off, I want to say, forgive the appearance, rollers and all. Um, I have not had a chance to tackle my hair or what, whatever, so sorry. Real life vlogging here. As you see, I started off with my coffee and some updates from my surgery. The surgery did go well. Um, for some reason, I was a tiny bit delusional thinking, oh, okay, small surgery, come home the same day, uh, I'm going to be fine. Um, I'm off the, the rest of this week um, to kind of heal, and to be honest, I need it. I think at times I have overdid it, and I could feel it, um, not so much in a lot of pain, but with the stitches and that weird pulling, um, so... I'm going to be mindful to really take it easy. Even with that said, I did want to take my dog for a walk to the park, which is actually just down the street. You know, it could be a very slow walk down the street. Um, so I don't have a lot planned because it's I'm off relaxing from work relaxing. I'm trying to do just that. and. And if you're like me, a doer, and you see things you want to take care of it, it's really hard to relax, even though you know you need to. So, I'm going to force myself into relaxation. Um, since I had my surgery, there has not been one day that I stayed in bed all day relaxing. So, that's not probably not good. <sighs> so, I'm going to do the coffee. Today is my carnivore day, so it'll be a meat day. Um, my schedule has been sort of off with my eating, and my body feels it and does not like that. So yesterday was I was really late with my meals, and that's not good. My body tends to like front loading everything, and then the rest of the day probably just digesting and all that. So I'm gonna try to get back on that schedule. The goal today not to eat past 2 p.m. Um, so it should be pretty easy. And I'm gonna drink the coffee and then show you guys what my first meal would be. And like I said, if I'm gonna do dog food, I will show you how to do that in case you have a dog and you wanna make their food. You know, everybody doesn't make dog food the same way. I This was trial and error for my um, first dog I had years ago trying to do a lot of research as to if they were in the wild what would they be eating as their basic diet to stay alive and stay healthy because we all know the the typical 
standard diet, even for us, even for what they prescribe for our pets, it is not the healthiest thing. So I did a lot of research and I kind of came up with a combination that worked pretty well. So that's what I'm doing here with um, Gunner. And he is such a love bug, just so wonderful. So coffee time. And again, forgive this. When I come back, I'll look better. <laughs> and um, then we'll talk about what is my first meal of the day. See you guys then. Okay, I am back from the store. Let me show you what I got. Okay. This right here is a beef brain. I believe that's what it is. Let me think. Let me see. No, excuse me. Beef heart. So, we have that. We have some beef liver. and chicken liver so i will be using those to make the dog food and it makes quite a bit of food so i do it in batches of maybe like for three to four days at a time so we're all set for a little while so i'm going to be right back because i'm going to get my first meal together because i am falling behind schedule so be right back Okay, here is my first meal. This is about a little over five ounces of skirt steak with a tablespoon of coconut oil. And I'm going to sit down and eat this and get back to you guys. Here it is, the chicken crust pizza. <sighs> I am very late eating my last meal, but... Oh well, I'm going to do better tomorrow. Hi everyone. So I am back. My last meal of the day is going to be the chicken crust pizza. Right now it is 4.53. So I'm late getting my meal in, but I will do better tomorrow like I said. Um, it's been a pretty good day. It's been a slow day. Kind of a boring day I'm sure for you guys to follow me around or for doing a full day of eating. I went and picked up a few things from the store for my dog. Um, I will probably do a separate video on that on how to do the dog food if anyone is interested. Um, but yeah, it's been kind of a slow, boring day. Um, I got a little bit more rest in. I'm going to eat and um, take a shower and just chill out and do nothing for the rest of the night. So I hope you enjoy this full day of eating. I will be back on Saturday. Thank you guys for sticking with me and for watching, and I will see you later.